Can you believe you don't need sticks to make a campfire? Well, you don't. You don't need them. <laughs> What's up guys, Dan here, Cold Cracker Bushcraft. So not needing sticks for a campfire sounds sort of crazy, doesn't it? Because we know we need to burn wood while we're out here. But here's the thing, there is other options. Now, when I say other options, it's like an addition. I guess you could do just this, but it's an addition to the wood. It's very plentiful in the forest, especially this time of the year, and it works really, really well. And that is these things, pine cones. Can you believe it? Pine cones work really, really well with fire starting. The number one nicest part of pine cone fire starting is that they're super abundant. So you can take something like a trap basket and fill that thing up super quick if you find an area of pines with these pine cones and then you can utilize these to get your fire started. Now what's really nice with these things is they're generally dry, they don't hold a lot of moisture and there's also that lovely sap. If you look at all of these little ends, okay, that's all pine sap and we know pine sap is flammable and it works really good if we can scoop it off a tree, but it's we can't always find it on the trees. So finding pine cones works just as well. So they light up really easy with an open flame source such as a match or a lighter. All right, so here we have our pine cone and you're gonna see just right up off the ground, something like this, it will light up. Now, depending on the conditions that you're in, it might take a little bit more flame or a little less flame. We're in a pretty dry environment here. It hasn't been too rainy. The rain's coming in today, but you're gonna see this thing, as long as I can keep my lighter lit, it's gonna light up not too bad for us. Oh, gotta switch over to matches. See, sometimes stuff doesn't even work too well for coal crackers, so we gotta get the good old matches out and strike one of these things and do it this way. So let's get, I know you can't see what's happening here, but we'll get this thing started. All right, get that flame up in there. The same as a stick bundle, right? So we get this thing burning working real nice for us and look at that that pine is burning and we're good to go so a great way to get that fire started okay is with these and then keep that fire going with these so make sure that when you're thinking about fire starting you're always thinking outside the box pine cones great addition what I like most about them isn't even really to get the fire started it's more now this time of the year you're gonna sleep on the ground you need that fire out front and you know at night at some point it's gonna go out while you're sleeping and you're gonna have just hot coals throwing pine cones on those hot coals works really well because those coals slowly heat them up they dry them out if there is any moisture in them they light up they start burning, they have a good smell to them, and you can go right back to bed. And you don't have to collect a ton of little stuff, you just gotta collect a ton of pine cones that are laying around to get that fire stoked back up and then put your big wood on top of it and you'll sleep like a baby. So hot tip here from Coal Cracker today, hope you give this one a shot, go play around with it, try some different devices, and then also don't be afraid to fail. You see I tried it with the lighter in front of all of you and it didn't work, I had to switch over to matches and the matches came through for us. All good. All right, so check us out over at coalcrackerbushcraft.com. Hit like and subscribe down below, all that good stuff. And then until the next video, stay in the woods.